greatest baby bro. That's his mother. That's that's not his mother. But since Deanna, I've been hit her uncle too. That's right. That's right. That's right. And these kids uncle too. And so I'm just proud to be able to join them in this uh ceremony this evening. Uh, first of all, I'd say, like to say good afternoon to all of you, and especially to thank God for this great opportunity. It is with pleasure and honor that I stand here with Monty and Deanna. Uh, and if there was a way that Miss Betty could be here, if we could see her face, we know that she's smiling down, saying, look at that Monty Lewis. <laughs> and uh, Mrs. Ferguson, I know the two of them would be so very proud of them. They have gone over and beyond. They've taken the challenge to be young people. They've taken the challenge to marry. They've taken the challenge to become great parents. And in seeing all that they have done, I think it's with great honor that they would be truly happy and proud of them. And so as I stand here, I'd like to let Monty know, Monty, your mom would be so proud of you. Get that old money. <laughs> And this is her daughter-in-law, Deanna. And I thank God, I do thank God for the opportunity to be able to um, stand. And we had fun co-parenting. Uh, we love our parents so, 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 so much. Nobody could ever compare to my parents ever in life. They always have our back, no matter if we're wrong or right, and they always come through, no matter what we are going through. Amen. Like, when I tell you God has really blessed me with great parents, I mean that from the bottom of my heart. When I pray to God late at night, when I am having troubles, my parents always answer my calls. Like, when I tell you nobody can ever compare, like, I'm so grateful. Like, it is ridiculous. Like, no. I am so grateful for my family. Like, I just pray that everyone can experience what I have experienced with my parents in life. I'm proud of my parents. I'm really proud of y'all coming out. It really means a lot. Uh, also, I want to give thanks to my mom and my dad. I feel like I got the best mom and dad in the world. Also, they do anything for me and also I really just want to take them for granted, really. Because you know in life, you can't take your parents for granted. Because once they're gone, they're gone. And you know what I'm saying? That hurts. Um, also, uh, I want to let y'all know, uh, the food was good. <laughs> so make sure I get uh, y'all a to-go plate. Okay, girl. <laughs> And thank y'all for coming out.
tears, joy, just nothing but love. And no matter how many knock down, drag out fights and arguments we've had, we've always, always loved one another. Amen. Always. And I just, just love, because you can love your fellow co-worker or your friend, but this love is so deep, no matter what, no matter what, he will always have my heart. He will always have my heart. I love you, Monty. I love my baby. I love my baby. I've been with my baby a long time. Man, we fight. Oh, we fight. That's the best teammate I ever had. I mean, no matter, no matter what's going on, baby, when I come home and you just say, hey, baby, it makes my day. And I couldn't have picked a better mother for my children. No better mother. You're the best mother. You're the best wife. You're the prettiest woman on earth to me. And I love you so much, Deanna. I would do anything for you. You're the smoke to my cigarette. You're the rain to my cloud. You're everything. And until the day that God takes us away from each other, I promise, and I wholeheartedly tell you, I will be there for you, I will stand there for you, and, and I will protect you. Wholeheartedly, baby. Like I said, you act right, you get anything you want. <laughs> I'm serious about it. I mean that. I love you. Happy 25, man. But we're going to be 78. That I can hold the ceremony of renewing the vows of marriage that join you and bind you as husband and wife. Please celebrate this renewal. Wow. 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 Wow.